dark place. The past 20 years has been under the rule of D-Force, and gradually they have abandoned Christian values. They speak about thy beauty rare, till hearts are set afire. Yeah, hey, fully thy servants there I say. My grandmother once told me that I would find the truth if I seek for it in the right places. She gave me a book where the secret was written and told me not just to think about it but do and speak. My heart can find no comfort, my tears like rivers run, my lamentations bitter. We're not fighting against humans. We are fighting against forces and authorities and against the rulers of darkness and powers in the spiritual world. And in that fight, I need help. Help from you. Hi, welcome to my HQ. This is where I hang around. So look around if you'd like and get to know the place before we start. Hey guys, how are you? So we are here with Gate Zero. Yes, I have been looking forward to this game for a while. Um, some of you may know, some of you may not know, but yes, I am a man of faith, Jesus is my king, my lord, my saviour, my everything. The greatest thing that's ever happened to me, to be quite honest. Because if it wasn't for him, I would not be here. It's simply a fact. He's the reason why I have what I have, and the reason why I am who I am. That is it. The reason why I'm still happy today. So, I am not here to force anything onto you guys. No beliefs, no nothing. Don't worry, I'm not going to be shouting, you know, screaming at you guys. Oh, if you don't do this, you don't do that, you... You're going to a bad place. No, it's none of that. Don't you worry. We're here to play this game. It's just the fact is this game means a little bit more to me than probably you could ever imagine. Because Ground Zero is a game based on going back in time to witnessing history unfold in the year 33. Pretty much um, back, you know, when Jesus was around. And I have no idea what this is. But as you can see... On the screen, you know, it's it's in a work in progress. This is a demo. This is a demo stage. So we're going to get into it. Let's go. I'm so excited for this. It's going to be really fun. What's this? Yes, it's the book. Oh yeah, I forgot. Hey, Hector. Hey there. I've been waiting for you. I'm just finishing up some final adjustments on the time machine here. I want you to travel back to a very significant event. This is going to be really crucial for us. We're ready. Where are we going this time? We're going to Passover. In the year oh, 33. Right about the year, so that's good. <laughs> okay. We're ready. Let's go back in time. Go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I'm looking forward to this. Get set. So Here I've we been go. watching uh, quite a few videos following these guys. Um, on social media, uh, I came across some of the videos on TikTok. I uh, did of this game being developed, and I was like, "Wow, I need to see this." Looked into it, and yeah, it's it's. I did not know they had a demo ready already, and I am well excited for this. 
Um, quick reminder, just to let you know, this game is probably going to be quite glitchy, a bit maybe stuttery, so I do apologise for any of the inconvenience of the graphics or anything, you know, not looking too pleasant because it's still in the early access stage. Welcome back to Jerusalem, to a very important time, Passover. This is the greatest celebration of the year for the Jews. And hundreds of thousands have traveled to Jerusalem in memory of their deliverance from Egypt and to offer sacrifices in the temple. Wow, it's a totally electric atmosphere. I can actually hear the roar of the city all the way up here. Yeah, you totally can. Does it sound like it's coming from the Golden Gate? See if you can figure out what's going on. Right, Jesus is Lord of the Sabbath. Oh, wow, right. Let's get into it, guys. This looks phenomenal. Look how big it is. Oh, my days. Oh, this looks phenomenal. You guys, you know, who've worked on this game, good job. Phenomenal job. Oh, wow, there's a time machine. Okay, there it is. Phenomenal. Absolutely amazing. Okay, what's this? Wait. I don't know much about the game so far. Um... I, I wanted to kind of like surprise myself with what there is. What's here? Oh, we got apples. Apples are good. Apples are very good. And I got a jump game, which is good. Oh, look at the little lambs. Hello there. Gorgeous. They are cute. Wow. It runs quite well, actually. But yeah, I just want to say I do apologize if there is any glitchiness or if it jumps a bit understand it is early access guys this is just a demo i think it's early access or it's just you know it's in the demo stage so hopefully you guys will enjoy this it is a lot different than what i usually play but as i said this means a lot to me this game already because you know it's something which has a massive impact in my life believe it or not if you asked me three and a half years ago uh, well, if you told me three and a half years ago that I was going to give my life to Jesus, I would have laughed in your face and said, behave, that'll never happen, right? Or if you asked me, simply asked me, oh, do you believe in Jesus? I would have been like, do I believe in him? I would be like, yes, I do believe that he was, he did exist. There's far too much, even someone who isn't a Christian or a Catholic, you know, you cannot deny the evidence of his, ex his uh, I can't even read now. You cannot deny the existence of him because there's too much evidence to back up, you know, he exists as, you know, they even found his, you know, his DNA, his, you know, his blood, there's, there's that, there's, there's cloth, there's dog, there's just so much evidence, so much evidence to back up his existence. But if, you know, if you asked me, oh, do you believe he was the son of God back then, I would have been like, ah, I don't know, I don't know much about it. Do I, did I used to believe in a God? Yes, I did always believe in an afterlife because... At one stage, I kind of did, and I didn't, until I got proven wrong, yeah, and yeah, I just, let's just say I learned the hard way, but it was, it was, yeah, it's just one of them, it's, it happens when it happens, and I will always say this, I let, you know, it's best to let it happen for other people, not to ever, to never force, you should never, ever, ever force your own beliefs on anyone, never, and I would never want to do that to you guys, at the end of the day, you know, I look at this way, I think God works in amazing ways, especially Jesus, and I think that in time, ooh, because it looks like there's going to be a lot of reading in this, <laughs> so this is going to be interesting for me, you know, you know what I'm like, guys, I'm dyslexic, terrible, I know, uh, it is a beautiful city, honestly, oh my days, it's phenomenal, but yeah, no, the fact is, I, I don't want to force anything upon you guys, Looks like there is a side mission there. We may check out if we have time. But I want to, uh, yeah, no, I just want to let you know that, listen, I know some of you may or may not believe it. That's completely fine. But I, as I said at the start, he is my everything. Hey, Max, remember why you're here. Really? We need to figure out what Grandma meant with her riddle. I think you have it with you. Keep your eyes peeled for clues that you might find along the Grandma's way. Grandma's riddle. Press R for riddle. Let's have a look. Oh, okay. Okay, here we go. 
I have no idea what that is. Uh, okay. Try to solve Grandma's riddle. Jesus is the Lord of the Sabbath. Through ways to look at their fill. Again, the Sabbath word. Um, uh, I feel like I should know that. I kind may have done. Where is my Bible? I actually do have one. I can't. I just think. Oh no, wait, it's downstairs. I'll have to downstairs. Um, yeah, no, it's. This is a phenomenal game. But as I said, you know, it's not everyone's cup of tea, I understand. But I'll tell you one thing it's definitely a cool, interesting game for anyone, even if you're not a Christian or a Catholic. You know, this is still a unique game. I mean, look at the sheer size of it. You know, it's, it's an amazing, phenomenal thing, and I only know a little bit of information. Hey, Max, look out for the guards. Make sure to hide behind obstacles to avoid their line of sight. You can throw okay, rocks at this. something that makes noise right. and distract them. So I, I, I don't know if it's true. I think I came across a video at one point saying that it's um that they actually have been helped by some of the uh, some people who've worked on some Assassin's Creed games have helped out on this on this game. I think. Oh, for love it. Hey! Who's prowling around here? Take it, take it, take it. No! Hmm. No! Who's Stop there? that intruder! <laughs> what was that? Welcome to the Temple Mount of Jerusalem in the year 33. Okay. Feel free to explore and discover facts about the city. There could also be some clues for Grandma's riddle around here somewhere. Hmm. Maybe Who's you could there? find answers at the most holy place. Like the priests did. No, they're not. Day's gone. There's did someone here. Oh, out of the way. They're not after me, still, are they? Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Bye. Bye. Oh, I got away. Yes. No, but this is how you run away. Is this where I'm supposed to go? Visit the holiest place. That's definitely it. <laughs> Ooh. Should I check the door? I love the beautiful music. Oh wow. This must be where they come to soak their feet and wash themselves. Maybe a bath of some sort? the priest rooms. Where are they? Where do I go? Hey Max, I have an idea. Okay, uh, what's up? What if we turn you into a priest so that you can get an even closer look at what goes on here? Are you up for it? I'm up for anything, but uh, how do we do that exactly? Okay, last time I came here I brought some highly specialized priest rooms. They've got technology in them that connects to your DNA, so that you actually become a part of the priesthood. Okay, are you serious? Where do you even get stuff like this? I made a time machine, Max. This was a piece of cake compared to that. Besides, this is a necessity. Remember, only those of the tribe of Levi can do the work of the temple. So you have to okay. become one of the tribe. Cool, well, I guess I'm going to try something new today. There is just one problem. Every time you say something like that, I've got to go on some kind of quest. What's up now? Well, I don't know if you could call this a quest exactly, but I can't remember where I stored the robes. I know that I wrote it down here somewhere. I have to look around a bit. Help me out and see if you can find something that gives us a clue. Sure. How am I... We are in Jalu... I can't, I can't speak, sorry. How am I gonna... Oh, well that's convenient. 
let's go. Hi there. Oh, wow. Wow! Oh, wow, that got big. This is so cool. I feel like it would be a lot more, obviously, yeah, a lot more busier back then. But, uh, obviously, it's still early access. I think they'll, you know, they'll probably fill it out a bit more, more likely, maybe, hopefully. There are some things that do probably need some sprucing over. Obviously, certain things are a bit glitchy, but I think it's brilliant so far. The voice acting is really good. I love the voice acting and that. It's really nice. The size of the map is phenomenal. It's really, really good. Some of the graphics are really good. I just love, pretty much love taking the sides. <laughs> dip -do, dip -do, dip bite, bite. Bite, I love that jump. Whoever designed that jump, genius. Jump, jump. Ooh. Okay. I feel like these might might be coming handy. Maybe if I keep going to them, I can go back and read them. That's what I'm hoping. Well, that's oh facts. Uh, is it open? uh, 24. Okay. So we got some facts. Okay. Let's jump. To I know that's a little bit of full damage, but how? No, no, come on, let's be reasonable. Let's, let's be reasonable, guys. I'm not that bad. I'm not, I'm not, but I'm this bad! That wasn't too bad. Happy days. Wow. This is so cool. You can kind of tell there's a lot of influence from Assassin's Creed. Um, in these games. It'd be cool if we can go into some of these houses, which would be really nice. Hmm. There, is there must be a way around these guards. Conveniently. Is that even a word? I invented a new English dialect of wording. Yay! Right, let's go. Let's go. This is gonna be phenomenal. <laughs> let's do something. <laughs> let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Sneaking around. Sneaking around. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go back. Uh, how do I? Oh, yeah. I just. Uh, Who's prowling around here then? That's what it reminds me of. Run, run, run. There's someone here. Oh shit! Ah! Don't ah! Get away. Oh dear! Intruder! I did not do it, kind sir! I didn't I did not do it! I bid you farewell! Goodbye! I don't want to, I don't want to lose any, 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 oh that's good, he's gone. <laughs> I got worried then. Who's prowling around? Oh fuck. Oh, 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 oh dear. Oh fudge. He's not. He can't see him again. Oh no, I didn't even hear him. I didn't even hear him. I don't even know, mate. That's crazy. Oh come on, stop taking potentially money off me. I think it is. Or should I just absolutely run for it? I just do this. Bye. Bye guys. No, they're not. Bye guys. There's oh, someone here. He said I didn't even see him. Don't try to run from me. I didn't see him. Why am I doing this to myself? I'm gonna lose all my money. No, I can't mess around anymore. I'm gonna lose all my money. Pick up the stone. Which I need to sneak around properly. Okay, so. Oh. Oh, oh, 
There's someone here. Okay. Oh, oh. Who's prowling around here then? <laughs> oh no. I'm so scared. I'm actually quite scared. Oh, oh dear, oh dear. Thanks for accent. What was Who's that? there? Who is that? He's doing this. Why? Maybe we are being um, followed. Just but it is Dave. What's that noise? Oh, that's pretty cool. It looks like something out of the Matrix. It's weird that. Oh. oh wow, look at the water. I'm guessing. Yeah, that, that works. Probably the water, but maybe not. Last one, happy days, I could just go back to the um I do I go back to where am I? Oh yeah, okay, okay, yeah, yeah, that's fine, that's fine. Yeah. Oh, oh! Too high. Okay, I did I did it, I, I did it, but I, I got caught. I I need to get better at this. This is kinda of scary actually, I'm not gonna lie. Mate, when you can't hear them and they're that quick, it's like, wow. Oh wow, so cool. Oh, this is amazing, it's really nice. You can definitely tell it's been influenced by uh, Assassin's Creed. But the music, oh, the music in this game is phenomenal. It's beautiful, it's gorgeous. Whoever did the... Uh, Phenomenal, beautiful. And whoever was singing at the start of the game gave me goosebumps a little bit. It's like, oh, wow. That was really intense. I love intense moments like that in the game. Okay. I have robes, guys! Robes! Ro I have robes. Hi there. Yay. I've done it. I am one with all of you guys. Oh, okay. That's a bit broken. Hello there. Hello. Oh, my kneecaps. Yay. 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 Let's go. Let's go. Yes. We're in. Ooh. Wait, I think I've heard about this, sh this sh place. Um... I, I don't know if it's true, I remember hearing the story of technically when Jesus, um, something about Jesus, I don't know if it was when, when he did die on the cross, something about a, sh a big, uh, something torn in half like a big sheep, I can't, I might be wrong, I don't know, I could be wrong guys, I, I have to. The showbread is baked regularly, so it's always fresh. This is to show our willingness to sacrifice to God. And when we replace it, we may eat the old ones. And you know what? It's just as fresh, even on the last day. But, but Abba, why are there only 11 breads here? What? One of the priests must have missed it. No. Max, would you be able to go and get another showbread? So oh. there are 12 here, as there should be. I'm not gonna lie, the bread looks good. What is it actually made out of? That looks like really good bread. I'd have that any day. Oh, okay, that, uh, it looks like we've got some goriness there. Uh, ooh, okay. 
Right. I feel like I need to collect them. Hi there, can I can I have one of your breads? Wait, what? But you have loads here, why do I have to get the stuff? Why? Oh, okay. Okay, we have flour, that's good. Okay, salt. That's all it takes to make it is flour and salt. Just looked. Did I not? Did thou not look? Oh, hang on. Uh, I swear I just. There is no more. Oh dear. Oh, okay. Whoa. Oh, oh, wow. Oh, wow. I did not know all this was here. Oh, okay. Happy days. It's a big room. Okay, I got plenty! Parkour! Get more stuff. No, no, no. Okay, we have enough! We have enough ingredients! Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go! I feel a... Uh, uh, one sec. Ah, yes. Thank you kindly! Bye! Wait, did I make it? Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. See you later. Let's go. Let's go, let's go deliver the bread. Oh, have we got this one yet? Right. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh. Hi. We got the bread, we got the bread. Let's go. Thank you very much. This is good. We always need to be willing to sacrifice as God has bidden us. The riddle? What's it say now? Uh, wait, what, what are these? Find the right for each symbol. Uh, oh, okay, one sec. Oh! What is that? Are there berries for the triangle thing? I've got no berries! What's that flowery one? That's, um... That's something, uh, I guess. That looks like string. I think, maybe. I don't know. Okay, which one's the other one? It's, it looks like that looks like an actual flower. Um, is that is that coin? Rock? I have no idea. I don't think I actually have anything. I need to write, I need to find the right stuff. I will need another bit of bread for this. Hmm. I need to find these things. Okay. Solve the riddle. Oh, wow. The spirit of the Lord must always be burning from this lampstand, so that we who follow the laws of God can be a light to all peoples in the way we live and react in life. Not by might, nor by power, but my spirit, thus says the Lord of hosts. What Hebron is saying about the lampstand is interesting. But there's something I really want you to pay attention to here, Max. 
Look at the light from the lampstand and see how it shines onto the veil. <sighs> see this, boys. This separates us from the most holy place, the veil. Only Caiaphas, the high priest, can enter past the veil, you know. He must bring blood with him as an atonement for our sins. He then enters and stands before the face of God, before the seat of mercy. It is there that he receives the counsel and the direction to help the entire country. Besides the high priest, no one could go past the veil. In a way, it was a physical division between God and people. Did you know that this is the veil that was physically torn in two when Jesus died? He brought his own blood there to atone for our sins. That's when the way was opened so that we could all have access to the Father through his Son. We can ourselves go to God now for grace and mercy in time of need. Okay. Wow. That was intense. So yeah, I, I thought it was. Uh, I can't remember if it was. Um, if it was uh, when he passed or some other time, but um, it said. Okay. Right. I need to get certain things. Things, some things. Um, oh, uh, right. This is a. Uh, I mean, nicest way I've worked on a farm, and the cows are treated probably a lot more um, better now than they probably did back then. I'm not gonna lie. Being tied to it, being that it's just there waiting, it's like, you know, at least something I feel, it's more of Right, let's see what's behind here. Is there anything around here that may be of any use to us? I don't know how long this demo is going to be, but we shall see. Because I just, I don't want to complete it too. I wonder if it saves my progress for when I go on to for when the game does release. I haven't checked actually. Okay, there, there we go. So we now know that I need to collect some things. One thing of it, it blows me away, but what really makes me happy is knowing that my name is in. 
I don't know how much you can say, but it's just amazing knowing that those, the name David's been going that long. Yes, my real name's David. I just call everyone called me David. The only person that usually calls me David is my parents. So, usually when I hear David, I'm probably in trouble all the time. Jump! Sorry. It's a little bit of parkour. stuff up you guys what should I do what should I do oh look at it it reminds me of the story of when Jesus went into the um, was it the temple and I think they were selling it was like a, mar a market like this and they were selling goods and stuff like live uh, animals and he just went no not a chance no way and Tipped over all the tables and that, told them, you know, should not be doing it here, should not be doing this. And yet, I think like they were like, oh, who are you to say that for me? Like, snap back saying, oh, who are you to say this and that? And he's like, you know, tear, tear it down and it will be rebuilt a few days later. I think it was, it was a, it is so much to remember when you get really, like, put time into it. But right now, I, I can't even remember because I'm just so immersed in this game. It's like, wow. I'm trying to find a race still. Uh, let's see. This is definitely the way we came in before, I think, but it's changed. do many miracles and I do love some of the stories. I think one of my favorite stories of one of his miracles was when a man came to him and he was very, very severely ill. I forgot what it was called, but it was very, uh, I think it's quite, the, it was quite toxic it was. Like it, it could be, you know, another person could catch it. And, ooh, I could buy stuff, happy days. And, it was easily transmittable, so if you touch the individual, you could catch it. And obviously, I th he was with uh, some of his uh, followers, Jesus was, and I think he was traveling. And he came out and he asked and pleaded for healing. And obviously, they were would have been freaking out. Like, oh, no way, get away. Like, you know, they don't want to catch it because it's, it was a highly deadly disease back then. Jesus just walked up to him and grabbed him and just like... No, that's I don't care what anyone says. I mean that's pretty cool. Like you know, he, the things he did, phenomenal. Most people be like, oh well, what proof and this and that. Like I don't understand why people always want proof for stuff. <laughs> the whole point of faith, just you just know it's weird. It's it's uh okay. So right, let's first go off with it looks like four circles. Like four circles. What is that? I don't think. Like that. The thing that looks like a flower, which is that, I think. I can't buy money, I don't think. Okay, what's this one? The triangle with uh, berries! Berries and all. Okay, let's see if I can buy. Okay, so, no, it doesn't look like it's got what I need. Where's he going? Where was he going? Can I, no. I feel like I have to go out and about in the world to gather these things. Which, I mean, that's, that's good. That means the, uh, yeah, like tables like this, like with money and that, I, I heard that you know, he flipped a lot. Let's see. Let's see. Yes. Yes, I need that. I need, I need to uh, buy. I think that's why it is what I need. Bye. Uh, 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 it's, it's glitching, it's glitching. 
Okay, there we go. Actually, that's it. I just need to do that. Thank you. What have you got? I think that's what one of them was. The riddle for the riddle. Which is... It's a coin. The flower. The flower. Right, the flower. Is... Oh, come on! What? What is it? Buddy... I need to get free. Maybe I need to get free. Can you go back? Hi there, sir. Can I buy... I'll buy three off you. May I buy three? Okay. So, Grandma's riddle. Okay, uh, no, go back. Go back to the riddle. Flower. I just got three! Why am I crazy? It is that! That is it! That is it! What? That looks like that thing and then... Uh, I don't know what that is. What is that? It looks like... That looks like string? Um, but that is definitely coin. Unless, do I need to get, do I need to go to the other one, right, let's see. Right, let's go, wait, is it this one? Three of them, bye, bye, bye. How many? Okay, I just, yeah, buy, buy four of them. What can I sell? I don't want to sell anything to be quite honest, I want to see what I've got. Okay, maybe... Is it the other one? I feel like this may take a little bit longer than I, should, than I was anticipating. Oh, throw rock! Oh, oh dear. Oh, 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 shit! Oh, oh, me, oh dear! Ah! Get some fire. Um, where do I go? What do I know what to do? I don't know. I feel like the stuff I may have to go out and find instead of buying it. What's over here? Oh, it's 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 nothingness. Oh wow! You know, one of the most amazing things is I've always wondered is. How did they even build this? How did they do this? Forget the pyramids. How did they even build something this big? How? Wait, like, that must have took so long. Oh. Um. But I'm confused. I I need help. Help me. Oh. Look at ding 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 Okay, I I feel like I've been everywhere though. Unless I need to go here. Hello? No? Do you have stuff I can get? No? Excuse me? No. No. Out the way. Out the way. Thank you. Uh Right. Maybe on the other side I have to go. 
Because I'm really confused of what I need to... Let's have a look. Because I don't know if I have to go out and find the stuff. That's the thing. And this, uh, I don't have much time to to play. That's the issue. I only have a short amount of time. I didn't think it would actually be this long so far. I mean, they know how to drag it out because you have to go search. I feel like. Wow, yeah, oh. It sounds louder, but obviously it's a little bit quieter, it's a little bit less. Hello there. How about over here? Do I have to buy anything up? Can you use some of them? Music is so intense. Yay, 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 yay. Oh, I thought that was another way out. Another area. Okay, there's some tents over here. I'm hoping that I'm not coming down here for nothing. Hopefully there's something. Uh... Okay, it's another fact. Looks like weapons. I don't think there's any combat in this game, to be quite honest. It's more story based, obviously. And a bit of sneaking around if, if you're good at it. back the way I came and there's a, an area there unless I go out to where those homes are those areas where there might be things I can collect around them that's what I'm thinking hopefully it would be nice if there was maybe something to help me tell me where I need to go it's so big And there's more! Oh, wow. Uh, that's a lot. This is a very big location. Hello there! Oh, she's got money! Money in it, in, in it. It's, what was it? Is that money? Is that people throw pennies in it? Yes, yes, yes. I need it. Let's go towards a good cause. I promise. Is it? Ooh. Linen. Back then, linen and stuff like that was so valuable and spices. Okay. Can we just keep looking around here? 
It would be nice if it was more filled out a bit. Like more people were around. If I was to explain it in a more simpler way. I think I think you guys understand what I mean. Because to me I feel like back then it would have been packed. People everywhere. Crowded. Uh, I don't know if you've ever watched a Christian movie or anything to do with what it used to be back then, but it would have been crowded. Very crowded. People everywhere. People buying stuff. Um, you know, asking. Like you can hear the remote like sound. Dear Lord, I wish for a new. Okay, so it's a prayer. Ladders? Can I climb the ladders? No. Okay. That was a no. There's a no. Okay. Okay. Herbs. I am coming to collect everything and all I can. I keep going for about another five more minutes and see where we're at. Hopefully, it, it saves my progress. I think. Herbs and stones. Oh wow, okay, yeah, no, that's good, that's good, that's very good. I just don't know if there's a limit to what you can have. I have a bucket. A bucket of the water! Everything for you guys to enjoy. I mean, it's obviously for me as well. So I'm, I'm just curious. The one thing, the one thing that made me hesitant about this game, and I mean it, I'm doing this, is that. Uh, ooh, regular red, happy days. Um, is that some of you may not know, some of you may know, I don't know. Uh, so, obviously. When you say the word Jesus, people have this already image in their head of what Jesus looks like. Long hair, beard, blue eyes, white, you know. The thing is, Jesus would not have been white. I, it, he would have had probably much more. I mean, it, it already explains in, in the uh, Bible pretty much what he looked like. So much more, yeah, it would have had more of a tan, more of a darker complex. But um, I'm just curious how they portrayed 
the way he looks. Like, I'm just, I'm curious. Because it's going to be weird. Because a lot of people just probably have this idea of, oh, you know, it's going to be a guy with long hair and a beard, that's it. Which, you know, I'm hoping that they, they keep it by the, you know, by the actual original. Because, well, I feel like none of us really truly kind of exactly know what he looks like. Like, we, we'll never know till, you know, we, we see him. Okay, so obviously I can't go any further. Yes, I will. Don't try to run from me. You can't catch me. I'm the Dave man. Hey. Can I, can I throw something to get the attention? What are you going to do about it? Stone. Stone. Hello, sir. Hello. Well, maybe just a. Bye. But no. He's Don't so Don't try quick. to run from me. I didn't realize how quick he was. Oh, I took a little money off me, hasn't it? Oh man, no. Me. Oh right. Well, do you know what, guys? I can show you the map. Oh, I can buy stuff. Oh, that that would have that would have helped. I'm not gonna lie, that would have really, really helped. I can get it. I can buy a horse. We're buying a horse. We got to leave. We've got to leave. Guys, look at the sheer size of this. Where is he? Where is my king? Where is he? Um. What time is it? I know I might have to bring this to an end yeah I have to I've, I've run out of time guys there's uh, only so much time I have uh, but it's, this has been really fun guys I've really enjoyed this and I hope you guys have enjoyed this game play as well which even though it's a demo I'm definitely going to be doing a oh! <laughs> just uh, fall to my death <laughs> as you do You know, um, you know, you know my name's Dive. Can I? Okay, I can't go there. Right, uh, hello there. How are you so tall? Well, I think I am a young, very young man, actually. I was going to say, um, oh, Dave, you've got some coin there. So, um, you know, this game's been phenomenal. But I was gonna say, back. In a year. Ugh, sorry. A little bit tired. Back in a year 33. I don't think many people would have been that tall. That's the only thing I would say. I was about to say he's really tall. I think most people back then were like five foot five. I think Jesus alone would have been quite small. Though. I don't know. I, I have no idea. I don't know what to really explain it. I don't think I ever really looked into it. But I think back then, a lot of people used to be smaller. Like, the average height must have been at least about 5'5 five, five or something like that, or five, six. Nothing like it is today where you've got people that are 7 feet tall nearly. It's like, what? What's this then? What's that? Right, okay. Anyways, guys, we're going to love you and leave you because I've got to go. I've ran out of time. Time is of the essence. But anyways, hopefully you guys are having a blessed day. As I am as well. Because... Ugh, follow me.
because it's been a wonderful gameplay. Absolutely wonderful. And I look forward to you guys enjoying this, hopefully. And yes, I'm definitely going to do another part because I think there is a lot more to this game that I can do during the demo. So we shall see how far we can go in this demo. So I'll see you guys later. Lots of love. Dave Lyon.